Hi friends, I have a very exciting morning planned. I'm off to meet Ree Pearson and I'm gonna ask her a few questions and I'm bringing you along with me. So I was a real gym bunny before and for years I always wanted to be thin. I wanted to be skinny and so and I just realized, wait then, that's not me. So I just thought, realized, wow, I wanna be like that. I wanna be strong. I want to, and I loved the different shapes, the different sizes, the different people that are able to do it and there, it's not about the way you look and I just love that whole ethos of this bit and yeah. how varied it is and I just love that and I just thought, yeah, this is for me. So what are we doing today then, Ray? Holding to uh, one RM um, power clean, hang clean and split jerk in 12 minutes. And then we are going into triplet ladder of, I believe it's toes to bar, double unders, and clean and jerk with descending reps, ascending weight. You got that, Finn? You ready? Multitasking mama. Big respect to all those cross fitting moms out there juggling work, babies, family, hobbies, side hustles, you name it. Friendships, relationships. And this is why I'm filming Bree. She does it all. That was horrible. Bree kept me going by doing toaster bar with me which was nice I managed to get out 12 but I'm not the caliber of gymnast she is that's like a 
That's part A. I need time to recover. Oh, I'm not over it, Finn. Your mum's killed me. Yeah. What are you doing? It's mine. <laughs> now, nah, I've in advertising. I don't know what is. A very busy woman. <laughs> so I started CrossFit six months after Jess was born, and it was actually my father in law who got me into it. Wire Forest is where I started, and they were the sixth box in the UK. And uh, my father in law said, Come and do this circuit type class with weights and things. We went along and uh, got hooked. My first ever workout was brown. <laughs> So Fran, for those who don't know, is uh, pull-ups and thrusters, <laughs> and it's redness. And so that was my first workout. I've got that image of you with that barbell down, like down in the yeah, like, bottom. touching my knees. Yeah. yeah. I was awful. My squat was awful. My strength was terrible. I was about ten kilos lighter than I am now. So I did ring rows and thrusters. Don't know if you can call them that. What did you find easy when you started? Nothing. <laughs> there you have it. Jack of all trades, master of none. Tennis, lacrosse, netball, swimming, 
surfing, windsurfing, sailing, anything I could growing up. When I surfed first, I crossed it, I thought I was fit, found out I wasn't. <laughs> Don't we all? <laughs> thought I was strong, found out, no. I still remember the day I got 105 kilo deadlift, which I think was double body weight at the time. And, That's and, insane. Uh, I remember getting my first handstand press up and rope climb and all things like that. So, still remember those times. Would you like some bacon? That's me. There you go. Thank you. Bacon is good for me. Bacon is good for me. Now for the gram. So, what's the question? So, you have quite the following on Instagram. <laughs> I do post Finn a lot in my stories. Um, who wouldn't? He likes to be in my stories. And then, um, he always asks, says, Mum, can I be in your stories? I try and put most of my fitness stuff on my main page mm -hmm. so it's very much fitness oriented things obviously in uh cloth bum yeah so reusable nappies and we get a lot of his clothes second hand um to try to promote reusable sustainability mm -hmm. um, which is what i've been really trying to push on through maternity leave hence uh, my love of lush as well yeah. What was, what's your highest placing in the Open like, for the UK? The UK, I think I was 11th last year. Wow. Um, in, the, in the Masters. Yeah. Yeah. That's, that's epic. And I think I was top 200 in the UK women as a whole. Yeah. Um, you want to be in it too, don't you? Last year, I think I came 450th in the world. Every year I've been improving, but going into this workout, I was. <laughs> so I was repping for another well-known American brand. Halo, um, so we do booty shorts and leggings um, now, and bras and also men's shorts. So the reason I started up was because I was repping for that brand and I just thought I was sending people to America to buy their things. And I was like, this is just, this is ridiculous. We're sending all these people to these big companies to buy their things. There's no reason why we couldn't start up our own brand. But we started, got the first samples around June last year when I was pregnant. And then it's just grown and grown and grown. And uh, I think we've had about <clears throat> two and a half thousand online orders now. It's been a pretty epic first year. And we're just trying to expand more and more doing, as I said, leggings now. Got some more men's clothing coming. So we're going to be going to more CrossFit camps. It's all very exciting and it's um, really good to see the business grow. And the amount of women who've never worn booty shorts before that now are is just yeah. incredible. That's what means a lot to me. Like a lot of women are now, um, so they've never worn them, but they love them. Yeah, it's an incredible feeling. I get emotional every time I hear it. So, so going through comp photos and seeing so much halo, like everywhere, amazing, amazing feeling. And I've had um, the same coach now for four years. So Shrunky does my programming but I still love training with everyone at full pen. I like joining in class when I can. Tips across it, I'd say, if you can, take a friend with you, because it is good to have that moral support. Just welcome everyone, everyone will welcome you. Smile, be on time. You don't want burpees on your first day. And be coachable. The biggest thing is be coachable because if you turn up thinking you know it all, you're never gonna get anywhere at CrossFit because I'm 10 years in and I don't know anything. I disagree, so. she knows a lot. <laughs> Who's your favourite coach? <laughs> Chunky. <laughs> What's your favourite CrossFit move? Toaster bar. Favourite gym you've ever been to in the world? Oh, I've got a few. Wanderlust in Bali, CrossFit Committed in Prague, that's my first ever drop-in. Oh. That was my favourite. Oh, yeah. I'm not very good at quick fire. Oh, CrossFit New York was amazing. I went there recently. Favourite pre-bod meal? Toast with avocado, bacon, mushrooms and scrambled egg with a bit of uh, chilli flakes. Is that what you've just had? Mm -hmm. 
and they have a smash with scrambled eggs, bacon, and Everything else, yes. No. <laughs> favorite um, girls workout. Yeah. Helen. Who's your favorite games athlete? Oh, Annie Flores daughter. Yeah. And Jamie Green. Which UK athlete inspires you most? <laughs> I love Kelly Friel. She's a lovely person, a friend of mine, and an incredible athlete at home as well. So, but she's, I love her, she's brilliant. What's your favourite CrossFit got clothing brand? <laughs> Halo Fitness <laughs> Euro. So Finn, which is your favourite CrossFit box? Yeah? What's your favourite move? Mm -hmm. Who inspires you the most? Oh, interesting. Um, what's your favourite clothing brand? You can whisper that to me. Mommy doesn't need to know. Oh. Who's a happy boy? He's a happy boy. He's a happy boy. Yes, yes. Look at him smile. Yay! Woo! Clap, clap, clap. Oh, oh no! She's so nice. Oh, so it's all coming out now, Ree. <laughs> Come in. I don't like sausage, really. <laughs> <laughs> I'm always in one. <laughs>